have people like Chris that comes around and does this story about homeless people, man. And it's pretty good that he does this story about homeless people, man. comes around and does this story about homeless people man and it's pretty good that he does this story about homeless people man because it lets the world know and it opens their eyes up to homelessness you know the, the government is taking all of this money and they are putting it into this thing into that thing but they really need to be putting it into finding places for homeless people man you know what i'm saying and uh i sit back and i i, I try to do things the right way I try to do things the right way. That sun is killing my eye. I try to do things the right way. I'm, I'm good right here. I try to do things the right way, Chris. I try to uh, say my prayers. I get up and I do things for the elderly and everything, you know. But sometimes it just don't work. It just don't work. You know, I'm a professional cook. But I got my paperwork and everything. I'm hey, a prof Hey, Willie. I can um, edit this. If we move over this way, would that be be better? Yeah. Would you like? I could just move it over like this. Is that is that better? Yeah, that's that's a lot better. That's sun okay. directly in my eyes. All right, go ahead. Yeah, I, and I, um, I'm a professional cook, and Lord knows I would love to go back to work. I had a little job this morning, man. It was a cooking cooking job this morning, and my back was hurting me so bad when I got up this morning, until I really couldn't even hardly get up out the bed. Couldn't hardly get up out the bed. Wow. Let me tell you, I would love to take a shower every day. I would love to brush my teeth every day. I would love to do things that all normal people do. But unfortunately, I'm homeless and I'm not able to do these things. So I, I have the same clothes on sometimes and it's not cool. You know, people look at you like, damn, you done had that stuff on for like four or five days. I know it's got to be stinking. You know, but I mean, it's nothing that I can do about it. There's nothing that I can do about it, you know. I would like for someone to just reach out and just have a seminar for the homeless people, man. To let people know what homeless people go through each and every day. Sometimes, man, I don't even eat. I don't even eat, you know. They have churches around here, but by the time you walk from where you at to the churches, they don't have anything. They don't have anything but maybe a bottle of water. And it hurts. Because you lay in the bed and you're hungry. And you're wondering where your next meal coming from. So I sit out here each and every day. And I try to get my little money. And I try to do the best I can. If I see another homeless person out here. Lord knows if I got 5 or $10 in my pocket. I give it to them. I give it to them because you know that's where your blessings come in at. God looks out for those who look out for others.